Hello everybody and welcome back. Let's spend a moment about talking about what is a data scientist. I often get asked, I want to become a data scientist, where do I start? What is the most important algorithm and the most important programming language um, that I need to learn? And can you just give us a checklist of the five most important things to do when I'm a data scientist? But I have to say, actually, it's a difficult question to answer. The role of the data scientist has changed massively over the first last few years. We are not looking for this one type of nerd uh, with a hood sitting in the basement and can code, who can do everything from data engineering to machine learning to optimization um, and is a strong communicator. That role has disappeared. It was a recipe for failure. We are now in a similar position to where we are with the medical profession. When we saw doctors starting off, there was only one type of doctor. And that doctor was basically there for whatever illness you had. But nowadays, doctors are highly specified and you go to a different doctor for every single disease that you might have or hopefully not have. And you can't run a hospital just by having 50 times the same type of doctor. That will not be successful. You need doctors for every single specialty, you need nurses, you need a lot of stuff around it, um, you need admin, and that is exactly that what we see in data science. You don't have this one unicorn anymore, the one person that does it all. So what does a successful data science team look like? A successful data science team, first of all, needs to understand the business. What is a corporate strategy? What is a digital strategy? And how can we build a, a data science team and a data strategy and use cases using advanced analytics and AI and putting it all together to support the overall strategy? Then we need to bring in all the stakeholders. We need to make sure they work together, the different teams work together and implement business processes like, for example, having a garage model. We have to have a look at the whole AI pipeline, and it has very different tasks, from design thinking, to setting up the right architecture, data engineering, machine learning experts, optimization experts, data journalists, or a data visualizationist. You might have not heard of the role of a data visualizationist before. A data visualizationist is basically somebody who takes the outcome of the data model and visualize it in a way that the business can make the right decision and understand what it's actually meant. You can't feed back thousands of code, lines of code of percentages, probabilities to a CEO. They want to say, understand, if I do what the model says, what is the impact? And what are the top three actions? And that is the role of the data communicator, data visualizationist. And all these different roles require different skills and knowledge, just like when you run a hospital. So what is important? First of all, do something that you enjoy. Um, there are roles with deep down math, graphic design, communication. Find what is your passion, what is your business that you want to be in, and then be an expert in your field. The amazing news is we now have data scientists in every industry. Universal Picture, for example, is one of the biggest employers in the US for mathematicians and data scientists. So combine, combine your passion and your skills in, in the industry that you enjoy. And then just, just embrace it. Just be the best person in your field. Don't try to copy anyone else and bring it all together and be who you want to be. And that's the recipe for success and being the right data scientist. Find a team that inspires you and that you can work together with. Good luck. I'm pretty sure you'll be successful. <laughs> Thank you.